welcome this is the energy vibration lazing for also moon and rising Virgos. i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back it has been such a wonderful time a successful time for everyone in this week because this week energy is going to full of a lot of changes a lot of successful um situation that is going to happen um, it is a week of judgment as we have the week of judgment we always think about information coming to us that we weren't aware of that um, was um, was kept um, um, not um, revealed to us and the the week of judgment is always bringing out and pushing us and bringing information to us that we weren't aware of the week of judgment is letting you know that you have a very very strong foundation in a relationship which is extremely good so you have the four of cups so whatever is happening well it's good whatever is happening you have very strong foundation in the four of cups is here so whatever situation you are having with a partnership business partnership or with people and with friends you have a very strong foundation in business and partnership in your life okay what I should say is that this week is beginning from the 17th until the 23rd it's going to be a wonderful extremely wonderful weeks so, um, it's going to be a week of showing you a lot of stuff but yet still showing you um, that you know the relationship that you're having it's good um, hold on to it if you're having a relationship with the Queen of Swords be aware of her uh, whatever is happening you're protected from her um, whether the Queen of Sword or the King of Sword okay you are an earth energy person and most of the time you guys go with these hair people but be aware um, whatsoever is happening the seven of ones is beside you and uh, the seven of wands and the two of wands so something is happening so you're being protected from this woman for a reason and I'll explain and go deeper in this reading the energy vibration Friday uh, Monday and Friday is going to be your best days Monday and Friday is going to be your best days what is so fantastic about this because I said the um, four of cups but it was the four of ones which is stability whatever is happening um, in your home your business your family life uh, you have a good strong foundation it is the four of uh, ones and the four of ones energy is fantastic because the four of one energy they also support the four of cups energy which is extremely good because whenever this card it's brings the four of cups which and the four of uh, um, uh, uh, ones which is the energy vibration of a good stable foundation and in the house it's going to be okay so you know this is extremely good this is a wonderful um, series a wonderful thing to do a wonderful understanding from something that is happening in your life and this is extremely good as I said on Monday you have the eight of Pentacles you're working hard on something keep going on Tuesday you have the seven of ones which um, your guides and angels are protecting you from something you're protecting yourself from something from someone middle from the week you have the Queen of Swords be aware of these people because they they I'm, I'm getting a, a, someone who is of a a Gemini this Queen of Swords is a Gemini be aware of her be aware of her okay and here you have on Thursday the two of ones and the two of ones is good because it's a portal that is going to open up on Thursday so Thursday is a good day to start manifesting stuff okay you have a lot of ones energy so it's all about um, your passion and yes of your work it's this week is about your passion your work and money your passion work and money the energy of love is here your passion work and money the energy of love is here what else is here is that on Friday you have um, the energy of 
the sun the energy of the sun is here so congratulations to you um, Virgos because on Friday the sun is here so this is a good energy because you begin the week with the eight of Pentacles and end the week with the sun the energy of the sun is a wonderful energy especially when you have the four of ones so whatsoever is happening business your relationships your private life whatever is happening for you Virgos in this week it's going to be excellent it's going to be excellent okay as we go to the weekend and we're looking at the weekend on Saturday whatsoever was happening the tower came in and a cleansing comes in which this is good judgment with a tower in the wheel is a huge cleansing so for you Virgos it's going to be a week of cleansing which is going to bring wonderful new energy vibration into your life but yet still this wonderful new energy vibration is going to bring you is cleansing you because you're an earth sign and judgment and the tower is a wonderful energy and that is showing you that you stand strong in whatever is going to happen you stand strong so the tower is going to break down and you are going to stand strong and come out on top okay as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the five of cups and this energy of the five of cups have came up um, more more uh, you know for more um, signs and it is okay because the five of cups energy is just that you are looking back at something for some people you had a relationship with a, the Queen of Swords and you're looking back at this and thought um, was it a good idea was it not a good idea or you're about to embark on a relationship with the Queen of Swords of the King of Swords and you're wondering if it's a good idea what is happening is that there is a situation and your spirit guides are protecting you from this queen of uh, from this queen of sword okay whatever is happening you're being protected from this queen of sword whatever energy whatever she is trying to bring about in your life you're protected from her so you know you need to be wonderful you need to be understanding you need to be aware of what is going on around you because obviously she is not as um, she's not exactly who you th think she is and I guess you know that or he is because you have to understand that and I'm, I'm, I'm getting a Gemini I'm getting a Gemini so whosoever um, is out there that connects with a Gemini whether in relationship love partnership business partnership be aware because the per you, you need to understand that Gemini's people have two different face um, they're they're twins so they have two different characters so each person vibrates with two different sort of characters so be aware that Gemini's they can be nice but yet still you have no idea who they are because they have two faces there are two faces so when they smile be aware smile back but always remember that Gemini people has two faces their character they can't do anything to change they were acts and they are born under that sign um, so that um, they can deal with whatever aspect of whatsoever is coming in so yeah you know they are two faces it's, it's their character so be aware so whoever this king and queen I am getting a Gemini it has to do with a Gemini that's what is happening so um, in business whatsoever happened is that doors of opportunities a portal is going to open up something is going to happen a portal is going to open up and with this portal being opening up you have the sense of uh, a lot of changes are coming in okay so this portal is going to open up and with this portal opening up you're you're thinking back on the past the past but you no longer need to think back on the past because the portal is going to uh, open up and the Sun is going to come in and it's going to clear what's to ever that was there okay so be aware of certain things certain aspects um, certain situations that are around you 
because they're placed there for a reason you'll be okay you have nothing to worry about okay um, the um, the we're using the energy of the abundance card and this is your first card focus on these cards focus on these cards focus on these cards this is the second card focus on these cards because it's very important and the message that is on them okay for some people I read the message I'm getting just leave it you guys will come out okay and understand that whatsoever is happening in your life it's for a reason and I'm saying namaste to the Vulcan to the next week